Yo, what's up guys? In this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to boost your FPS in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 7 on a low-end PC in literally under two minutes. What guys takes is a simple program which can be found on my Discord and I'm going to show you everything step by step. And if you guys want to support my work, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, the program I'm going to show you in today's video is called Ultimate Windows Tweaker 4.8. And yeah, you can simply find this on my Discord guys. The Discord link is going to be in the description. I have many other more programs there as well on how to reduce input delay and stuff like that and an active community where you can ask pretty much 24 7 over 7.5 thousand members about help you know if you have some issues with your pc and yeah guys once you got this program you're actually on your desktop just simply double click onto it and press the automotive windows tweaker 4.8 exa and yeah just simply launch the program I already did it here in the background and this is how and this is how it's going to look like in the first place. It's going to tell you literally everything about your PC, Windows 10, Ryzen 7, 3700X and stuff like that. You have literally so many options and tweaks here in this tool to optimize your Windows screen, the animations, the text fonts and stuff like that. But what we want to mainly take a look on is of course the performance section because this is where the magic happens and boosts our FPS on Fortnite. And once we open up this menu here, you can see on the right side that we have tons of things to disable. We have the Windows Time Service to disable, Tablet Input Service, Disable Windows Security Service Center. This is probably one I would leave on because, you know, that's like the normal stock antivirus of Windows 10. But for the rest, just simply copy everything, you guys. You can disable everything, especially a super fetch service. If you leave this on, this is actually going to cost you so much more FPS and system power, which could be used for Fortnite to boost our FPS. And since we just want to go for maximum FPS, just copy everything here one by one and here on the left side also put here the check on turn off search indexer that's also super important guys and also disable edge tab preloading also super important guys microsoft edge no one uses that really on windows 10 like let's be honest we all use google chrome or some other stuff and if you're unsure if you actually want to change everything you can also create a restore point before you actually apply this you know but trust me this is all so super safe and it's just gonna free up your mem system power cpu power and boost your fps on fortnite and then once we applied everything correctly, we're just gonna press here apply tweaks and usually there should be a window like telling you do you really wanna change anything? But since I already did it, uh, for me it just says there's nothing to show right now. And yeah, with that said, you're already done here, guys. You applied everything correctly. And then we can close the program. This is just like a one-time thing. You don't have to let this run in the background consistently. And trust me, you're gonna notice a huge FPS improvement. And yeah, guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And as mentioned, we have over 7.5 thousand active members on my Discord. So if you have any more questions towards Fortnite optimization on low end PC, on on a laptop or whatsoever you can simply just go there and ask and with that said have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and until next time stay awesome i'm out peace